Hey, calm down for a second, okay? Hey. Hey there, I suck six fans. Daniel McCabe back with you. Notice I'm not wearing a shirt and tie anymore. It is summer after all, and uh, I don't wear that all year round. I am a fan of summer, though. The boys of summer. Uh, baseball, uh, you know, barbecues, all that good stuff. Wrestling, right? that's synonymous with summer, right? Contrary to popular belief, I am not a fan of the San Francisco Giants. But one thing I am a fan of are the innovative ideas that I Sucks Dicks comes up with. And here's a brand spanking new one for you. The Dick in a Box. Simply put, it's a gauntlet match. You draw out a little bubble, it's got an order of when you enter, and it also has a stipulation that your fall will fall under. A little bit of a twist on things. The winner of the whole deal, the guy who outlasts everybody else, is the first ever holder of the dick in a box. They might have to hold it here, or I don't know, well, probably. Um, and that guy can challenge the I Sucks Dicks champion of men fighting and grappling to a title match whenever he wants. That's a, I mean, a gauntlet match is not easy, but the reward, definitely worth it. So we got our guys here, uh, Let's, uh, well, head off and let's, uh, got these, the matches in the, in the bubble. All right, first guy, let's go. Okay. All right, Dr. Unk, draw one out. All right, keep them coming, keep them coming. Special K. Oh, sorry. My bad. Mr. Telvin. Keep coming. Okay. Let's uh What's going on dudes? Uh draw a thing out of the hat. It's what am I supposed to be doing? Just you draw a uh, little bubble out of there, uh, it tells you what uh, the stipulation order of entry for the dick in the box. Whose idea was this? Uh SNL's, I guess. I don't know. Mm, I wasn't even supposed to be here today, bro. Sorry man. There you go. All right, all right, keep them coming. Senior Cerveza, here we go. Oh, dude, you got the brown one. That means you go first. Oh, I don't, uh, uno, I don't, uno. Uno. Me, uno, uno, ha. All right, we got, is there, is there anyone? Hmm. We've got one more left in here. Interesting. All right, well, we'll see how that goes. See you in the ring.
glove you use for coal mining. It's got some steel in it. If you punch someone with it, it is... Where's the glove? I'm not even sure. Where? Oh, hey, look. Conveniently up there. You gotta grab it from up there to use it. Bring it down! types and stuff put in there. I handmade the box myself and I got one left over. I mean, why do I even have one of these left over? That's why.
I saw something amazing, okay? Daniel Maccabe in sight. Textbook, it was great. It was, it was an awesome match. But Daniel Maccabe beat Psych in a non-title match and, and now he's getting a shot at the title. That, that's all you gotta do? Hey, hey champ, I'm, I'm gonna beat you and, and then I'm gonna beat you again. Uh, I'm gonna take this approach. I'm gonna do a dandit. I'm gonna go beat Psych right now and earn myself a title shot. Come on, let's do this. champion in every match that I have should be a championship. Wow. I always accept I agree. What, what, are you, what, are you, what are you saying? Sam? What I'm saying is this is a championship match. Oh! You realize what you've done.
There's a lot of dicks coming your way. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. This is my dick in a box. This is my dick in a box. Cash, 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 cash. And not Johnny, cash it in. Cash it in. Cash it in. Get it? So we... Get a, get a rep. We get a rep? Is this a match? Oh. Oh. Yay! Yeah. I don't... <laughs> what is holding that box up? I just read some very disturbing news on Twitter. I happened to follow at Drew Sarian, and I found that he is taking credit for last show's attack on Caden Telvane, my tag team partner. Now, as we all know today, Caden came back to win the dick in the box. Or so we thought. He and I flipped the coin, had an arm wrestle, had another kind of wrestle. He came out on top, and even though his finger is broken from that horrific attack, we decided he would win the dick in the box, hang on to it for a year, however long it takes to heal a broken finger, and come back and cash it in on some poor, unsuspecting world champion. But then Drew Siri came back, screwed Caden Telbane, and now we got nothing. And Drew Sarian, you think you can just attack Caden Talbane? You think this is a what's good for the goose is good for the gander situation? Because we attacked you, and now you can attack us? No, we are neither a goose nor a gander. We're a goddamn tiger and a wolf! That's different! God damn it. Drew Sarian, you can't do that. And now, most important of all, or at least equally important to everything I've said up to this point, is I have no partner for the pay-per-view next show. I'm screwed again for another pay-per-view. You know what? I'm much smarter than all of these people. So I bet I can figure it out. I bet I can make this work. Yeah. No, pay-per-view. Pay-per-view's gonna go good for Scott Hansen and Caden Talbain. Even though he's horrendously injured! Damn it.